Single Player Gamer here bringing you five reasons why I love to use peakmonsters.com alongside Splinterlands. This is Splinterlands and this is peakmonsters.com. Make sure you hit that like button for your girl if that sounds interesting to you. And please leave a comment down below. Let me know. Do you use peakmonsters.com with Splinterlands? Because I would love to know. I've been using peakmonsters.com since June 2021. The first reason why I love peakmonsters.com is because you can make money by renting cards to players. And you can do much more than that. I know what you're thinking. What is peakmonsters.com? Well, so this right here is docs.splinterlands.com. So this is on the official Splinterlands website. Peakmonsters.com is the leading offsite Splinterlands Explorer. Peak Monsters is a third party Splinterlands Explorer market and interface that was created in the earliest days of Splinterlands. So there you go. It's right there made right alongside Splinterlands. Peak Monsters allow additional market features such as bids, rentals, SPS dashboard, all market activities, pack openings, season rewards, combining of cards, and market history page. So using rentals is the number one reason why I use peakmonsters.com. The second reason why I love peakmonsters.com is its seamless interface. Once you understand Splinterlands and how these cards work, as soon as you can understand wild and modern format, rebellion, and all these different types of categories, the gold, the units, the summoners, the differences, the epics, the legendaries, everyone that has some knowledge of Splinterlands can understand Peak Monsters easily. And also putting up cards for rental is very easy. I can check out my own collection here as well as post rentals. It shows me how much money I have over here. It says my crypto name here for Splinterlands. It says how much the total value of my card should be worth at the list prices of the players and also using market prices. That's what I suppose the game says it's worth $3,000. I remember before this used to say $30,000 right here. Back in the day, but that's besides the point. So this is peakmonsters.com and it's very seamless. I can check out my land here. I can check out other assets that are for sale. And that is the second reason why I love peakmonsters.com, that seamless user interface. The third reason why I love peakmonsters.com is this passive income that I can make using peakmonsters.com. So we can click market. I make passive income with Peak Monsters by putting my cards up to the market for other players to rent out. This is me, the owner based crypto, and is, I have a card delegated to somebody who decided that they wanted to pick up my daily rental, a delayed Brightwing. So shout out to Nalgar Green for renting out one of my cards for six days, five hours, 32 minutes and counting here for 0 0.349 DEC a day. How much DC a day is that? Well, that is just fractions of a penny. Extreme fractions of a penny here. Four zeros, then a three, then another zero, right? And that's going to accumulate into crypto millions. And that's why I love Peak Monsters. I have 532 DEC a day up. How much would that be worth? Right now, this is the price of DEC here on April 5th. 0.008673. Well, I have 532 DEC up for rental. So I have all my stuff put up here and expecting a whopping 46 cents a day. Less than 50 cents a day is what I'm expecting. And we only have 429 DEC worth of cards being rented out. And that's just 37 cents a day, everybody. But 37 cents a day will add up here on this rental card system. But I'm seeing here that I'm not even asking for much on my Peak Monsters, so I'm going to have to make some changes. It has a very active marketplace, okay? So here I have my Bakjira, Bakjira, delegated to Curry123, all right, for a low price. We got Dejan Myriad out here, delegated to Lucido Burrito for $2.99, and I'm going to say shout out to my Filipino viewers, okay? And I also want to say shout out to my American viewers and all the other viewers. A lot of people to be tuning in from around the world, and I appreciate you all. We got Quicks the Devious here. Luke89144 decided to rent it out. I appreciate that. And that's just some legendary cards, but we can also look and go here, 
Check out just some regular gold foil cards, which is something that I focused on for my rental card market here at Base Crypto Shop, okay? Base Crypto's card shop. So we've got Alric Stormbringer for rent, Lizard God, Ed Curry God, Bagdira, like we said. Somebody renting out my Cerberus here. Draco, Draco Zarbearer. Shout outs to them. All right. Shout outs to My Long, Luang, Renna Contessa, T Doan079. So this is an active market. I'm just saying. I just put these cards up for rent for pennies and for fractions of the pennies on the dollar. Okay. And people actually rent them out. So it is a form of passive income once you get an investment. Now compare this to invest in the stock market, I'm not literally going to see the dividends until whatever quarter that company decides to let me have access to the dividends. And a dividend from a stock is just when you hold a stock and the stock company gives you some kickback for holding the stock. So this, in this way, I look at it as my cards are the stock and Splinterlands is giving me kickback from the stock. But it's not like that because this is actually the third party market. I'm using the Splinterlands cards on a third party market and these are players renting it out so in my opinion as a gamer that's even cooler and that's the fourth reason why i love peakmonsters.com active player usage the fifth reason why i love using peakmonsters.com is i get some pkm i earn pkm every time i purchase here using peakmonsters.com and this pkm is a cryptocurrency that i can exchange for BTC and eventually real hard earned money, you know, USD, you know, or silver, whatever. It doesn't matter. I'm just saying this currency that I can exchange for other types of currency that's worth even more. So I earn PKM every time I purchase a card. And it's pretty cool. And I appreciate that about this website. And that's very interesting. There was a long time before I even started buying cards on Peak Monsters until I seen that I could earn PKM. Because at first I was just buying cards here off of the Splinterlands Marketplace. But I wasn't earning any extra crypto, so I decided to just make every purchase here on peakmonsters.com. And that's the fifth reason why I love using peakmonsters.com. You earn PKM coins every time you make a purchase. Everybody, those are the five reasons why I love peakmonsters.com. Those are the five reasons why I simultaneously use peakmonsters.com alongside Splinterlands. One of my biggest NFT investments, crypto investments, investments in general. Just because you stayed here till the end, these are two other reasons why I really love peakmonsters.com. Two bonus reasons. The first reason is its longevity. The game launched in 2018 and Peak Monsters has been around since Splinterlands has been around. In my experience from using peakmonsters.com, it hasn't had any downtime. There hasn't ever been a time where I haven't ever been able to actually access peakmonsters.com or post cards on peakmonsters.com. And yes, I'm knocking on wood, okay? I really appreciate the longevity of Peak Monsters. I really feel like it is a very solid third-party application for Splinterlands, and I've been using it, like I said, since like 2021. This could have been in the top five, but I say one of the most important reasons to use peakmonsters.com here for the bonus. The seventh bonus reason why peakmonsters.com is one of my favorite websites to use is its extremely low fees usage. It looks like, like I was going to put my Century Mage up here for rent. We go over here, we press rent. We go here, I press set to lowest. So the lowest one is 18.66 DEC a day, one card, and the uh, Splinterlands listing fee defined by Splinterlands, all fees are burned, one DEC, it would just cost one DEC for me to put a card up for rent, and here I can possibly earn, I suppose, a 25.27% yearly return on this card for just posting it up here for one DEC a day if somebody decided to rent this card out. Of course, the low fees, the low fees in peakmonsters.com are amazing. And it is the final reason why I love using peakmonsters.com. I hope you guys hit that like button for your girl. Leave a comment down below if you enjoyed this video. Please consider becoming a member and helping out this page and helping me out and helping out the content. All right, I appreciate you all for watching. Make sure you all have a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.